Hello YouTube, Computer MD of Gilbert here, and today we are going to uh, put a countdown clock, or at least show you how to put a countdown clock in your Wix website, whatever you call it, countdown clock, uh, ticker, uh, whatever, but uh, when you see it, you'll know exactly what I mean by countdown clock if you didn't already. Anyway, this is sort of a little update video as well. Um, I know I've been posting on and off and uh, not very consistent. Uh, I just wanted to say, I first off, I apologize for that. Uh, I do really care. So uh, that's why I just wanted to inform you a little bit with this video as well. Uh, I'm going to try to post a video at least once a week. Um, sometimes I'll post more. Sometimes I might not even get one. But I'm shooting for one a week. And um, some cool updates. Uh, I'll be starting some Q&A videos coming up here uh, very shortly. In fact, uh, real shortly, I might even have one with a pretty cool tech teen YouTuber as well. Um, not going to tell you who that is yet. I want that kind of be a surprise, but I will tell you he's an awesome YouTuber. Um, and we'll see how that goes. I'm working on that now. So, anyway, be looking out for uh, Q&A videos. I'll create a quick little landing page website for you to be able to um, go to and ask your question because I just think that'd be pretty cool um, and we'll get some Q&A videos rolling so anyway countdown uh, clock you go over to our handy dandy add button our no sorry <laughs> my bad you go over to our app market when you're on the app market as it loads you're going to type in in the search count down clock press enter and then you see this it says mobile ready but it's a countdown clock you simply click add to site now you'll see you have a nice big countdown clock you can resize it any way you need it uh, you see I just made it real big there um, and then to change it or to adjust it you simply double click it and then it'll bring up the settings you could change like the style you could have the black with the white text or the white with the black text either way you could change the font size or sorry the font itself uh, the font color the background color of the clock you could change a lot of things but to change the time and the date and all that you it's a little hard to see but you click settings down here and then you see you could adjust your date you could adjust your time when you click that it'll bring up a little calendar you just choose what date you choose the time of the day now remember this is going kind of off military time so zero zero um, is obviously 12 a.m. and uh, and obviously you could do it from there uh, you pick the minutes, the seconds if you want to, and then make sure you pick the right time zone, especially if you're like a local mom and pop kind of shop. Uh, you want to make sure you have the right time zone so people will know. Then obviously you could adjust what it says afterward, and uh, and you could edit like the text. It, it doesn't have to be date, hours, minutes, all that, seconds. Um, so it's pretty customizable and it works really well. You can see when I preview it just right there works well and all together in a website it looks pretty cool so that is as simple as it is to upload a countdown clock in Wix it works uh, runs very well you can see the ticker right here how it flips the card kind of um, so definitely be looking out for more of my videos remember Q&A videos will be coming up very shortly uh, I'll make a video very shortly with the website that you could go and ask questions and definitely be on the lookout for that Q&A video I may be making with that other tech YouTuber. Anyway, if you like this video, please like and uh, also please comment if you have any questions or you're curious or you just want to tell me thank you or uh, ask me some questions about Wix. E either way, everything's fine. And um, give me a subscribe if you like my channel, if you like my videos. Alright everyone, I'll see you on my future videos, and uh, adios.